My name is John Wagner. Uh, my title is uh, Technical Manager here at the Oak Ridge National Laboratory. I also have another role uh, for the Department of Energy's Office of Nuclear Energy, where I'm the National Technical Director for their Nuclear Fuel Storage and Transportation Planning Project. So I have the opportunity and privilege to be a part of a really highly regarded team that's, that's working to solve the national issues related to the management and disposition of used nuclear fuel. Whether it's making a difference in terms of how the Nuclear Regulatory Commission makes regulatory decisions, or whether it's how a decision, we, we do the technical work that a decision is made by the, uh, by the, by the Department of Energy. So currently in the United States, we have about 100 uh, operating nuclear reactors that are discharging about 2,000 metric tons of, of used fuel every year and a backlog of about 70,000 metric tons a year that are currently safely and securely stored at the nuclear power generating sites. Now to put it in context, 70,000 metric tons sounds like a whole lot of material and, and, and from a nuclear standpoint, it, it is a lot of material. But if you were to stand up these assemblies uh, side by side, and one layer deep, you would not even fill up a, nuclear, a uh, football field. And so from a volume perspective, uh, it's really not that much materials. But for long-term sustainability of nuclear energy, we really need an integrated uh, governmental managed solution. The decisions around how you do that and where you do that uh, have tremendous uh, operational and cost implications. Right now we're pursuing interim storage. This would be uh, de-inventorying the material from the current generating sites so that we can repackage it and prepare for ultimate geologic disposal. The ultimate solution is geologic disposal. Because it is nuclear, people are concerned about the safety and security of these materials. And so we, we have an opportunity to directly influence that, perform the, or provide the technical basis for the safety of those materials and to be able to demonstrate that to the public. And so that's really an important opportunity that we have. I came to Oak Ridge National Laboratory for the opportunities that it provided to influence major problems or, or challenges for the nation, particularly in the field of energy. Uh, I actually spent a couple years in private industry uh, working in, in, the, in the spent fuel storage area and uh, wanted to expand more into the research areas and uh, be able to make kind of broader contributions actually. And the, the, one of the really nice things about a national laboratory as well is that you're able to interact with, with a really a wide variety of very intelligent people across uh, a variety of technical disciplines to try to assemble teams to solve these large interdisciplinary types of problems that the federal government faces.